Hi, this is Jimmy V with SM Lawrence Company. I'm standing downtown Memphis in front of the FedEx Forum, home to the NBA team, the Memphis Grizzlies, and the University of Memphis Tiger Basketball, plus a lot of other events and concerts that go on in downtown Memphis. What I want to talk to you about today is a product that we installed. It's a power conditioning product made by the company PowerWorks, or owned by Continental Power. We installed 21 of the devices back in October of 2009. So we've had about nine months of data. So we're going to take a look at the product, talk to Clayton Poff, who's owner of Energy Cost Reducers here in town, who represents the PowerWorks product. And we're going to look at utility bills, interview the chief engineer, plus the vice president of Arena Ops here at the FedEx Forum. So come on in, let's take a look. Hi, this is Clayton Poff. Uh, I'm one of the owners of a company called Energy Cost Reducers, and as was told earlier about uh, the FedEx Forum's Energy Efficiency Project, uh, here's the actual hardware that has uh, caused such a, a great uh, situation with the reduction of the utility bill. What we have here is our fluke meter. Uh, this is a data logger, and the key to the data logging is a uh, power quality assessment allows us to know a pre and then post of what uh, these particular power quality conditioners have done. Now, Continental Power's uh, manufacturing of these is actually in Tennessee, and, and these particular devices uh, are rarity on the market with their particular three technologies. They've synergistically put the three technologies of power factor correction, active harmonic filtration, and also interior and exterior surge and spike protection with industrial grade MOBs. And really what that does with these three technologies synergistically working together is that overall throughout the entire facility, for these two boxes are just two out of 21 spread throughout the facility, it really reduces the heat on every electrical wire within an entire facility. And that's where the reduction of your utility bill comes with the reduction of heat. So that power quality conditioning in and of itself done with these three types of technologies synergistically working together is a proven technology for reducing the overall utility bills, uh, both kilowatt hours and KW demand. Again, one of the key elements of this and the engineering of this is the uh, data logger, which allows you to understand what the facility's needs are. And then these devices are actually manufactured to spec to the building facility. It's not a one-shot wonder. It's not a... Uh, uh, one size fits all. It's a pre-engineered power quality conditioning system specifically designed for individual job sites. Since the installation of the PowerWorks devices, we've seen a dramatic decrease in any power fluctuations within the building. Departments that we have in the building that rely on electronics have seen fewer instances where they've had to reset of equipment because of voltage fluctuation. With regard to installation, it went fairly smooth. The uh, installation team was out within a week, and we didn't have any interruptions at all with uh, any of the power in the building. So if anybody is looking for a product that will give them true clean power, I would strongly recommend installing this product. Yeah, welcome inside the bowl of FedEx Forum. Uh, as you can see, we're getting a little bit of work done today. Um, my part of uh, the operations is, is mostly to handle the budgets with the engineering department. And one of the things we look at is return on investment when we go to our ownership group and tell them to uh, lay out some money for a product that I think will save us money in the long run. Uh, I can tell you right now that this product has worked. Uh, we are probably a little bit ahead of schedule on the return on investment in the nine months we've had it. Uh, so we're very pleased with it. Uh, we thank SM Lawrence for 
uh, bringing the product to us and also uh, doing the vetting process of making sure the product was going to work and return our investment for the ownership group. Uh, a few of the things that's also helped us with uh, on the chillers, we've had to replace some uh, cards in years past at you know $7,000 a card, replacing two or three of those gets expensive. Uh, also we, we've noticed that we don't have to reset the shunt breakers uh, as much and actually uh, very few times in the, the nine months that we've had it so we can definitely tell the brownouts have uh, minimized if not come to uh, almost none. But anyway, it's a product we believe in because it's, uh, it's proven itself, and we hope it works for you.